shot of Marlon Brando, the beginning of The Godfather, with dark mm. pools under his yeah. eyes, and a man being asked essentially for blood justice. Right. Can you explain that in simple terms, what you're doing? I mean, the easy answer is, is my understanding, it's a wide, big, top soft, top source of light, but I don't know. Well, you're, you're, looking, for the, you're looking for the formula. You know, uh -huh. there, there is no formula. Uh, the formula comes out of you. So whether it's a top light or whether it's some other thing, it just happened to be that's what was necessary to do this particular movie or this particular scene. So I did it. But <laughs> bottom line is the design behind all of that or the thinking behind the design of all of that yes. came out of Marlon Brando because Marlon had this uh, makeup stuff that he was using. You know. So top light seemed to be the most effective way of dealing with him. You don't really want to see his eyes. There was a big, big, big Hollywood rush about, you can't see his eyes. That's right, you can't. <laughs> Until they were revealed a little bit later, it began opening things up a bit. But, so he didn't really know what he was thinking about, you know, all the time. So the essence of top lighting for that movie was him. So, but you can't just do it for him. You have to extend it into the whole feel of the movie. So that's what I did.